Does this incredible new discovery mean we should believe in fairies after all? Chinese archaeologists recently unveiled an intriguing new discovery of an ancient community that worshipped fairies after unearthing a unique treasure trove at the famous Sangxingdui site. Sangxingdui in Guanggan, Sichuan, has long been a site of archaeological finds. Since 2020, researchers have been digging a sacrificial pit at the site, uncovering nearly 13,000 of his archaeological items dating to the Bronze Age. The ruins he covers an area of 12 square kilometers, 4.6 miles, and are believed to be the remnants of the Shu Kingdom from about 4,500 to 3,000 years ago. In June another discovery was made, this time a treasure trove of bronze, gold and jade. At least 10 of the unearthed bronzes were unexcavated. Experts believe that these finds show that people at the time worshipped fairies. Among the found carvings was a bronze box containing a green jade vessel. The top and bottom of the jar are covered with turtle-shaped mesh lids, and the sides of the box are decorated with bronze hinges with dragon-head-shaped handles. A bronze head with a gold mask, a bronze sculpture with a human head and a snake body, a bronze altar, a huge bronze mythical creature, and a dragon-shaped bronze object with a pig's nose. Found. The carvings are very intricate and imaginative, reflecting the fairy tale world that people imagined at the time, showing the diversity and richness of Chinese civilization, said the excavation leader. Said Zhao Hao, associate professor at Peking University. 8. So should we take fairies seriously? Maybe. Though they may not be the tinker bells or fairies you think of. The word, fee, comes from the terms, fi, Old English, and, fair, Old French. Like Morgan Le Fay in King Arthur, it refers to women who were healers and sorcerers. A powerful spirit. These spirits can be friendly or cruel depending on their mood. The latest find, the Sangxingdui artifact, sheds more light on this mysterious civilization that existed around 316 BC. Destroyed by the hands of the Qin dynasty. These objects are believed to be offerings for communicating with spirit fairies. Two archaeologists report that spirits were especially worshipped during this period. However, Eri is not a being relegated to antiquity. In Chinese tradition, the eight fairies are still worshipped gods. Fairies were humans who achieved immortality through the constant practice of Taoism. Whether or not you believe in fairies, spirits, or other beings, the historical significance of these recent discoveries is undeniably fascinating to all of us. That was the discovery by Chinese archaeologists about fairies. Thank you for watching this video. Help subscribe so this channel can grow more.